Welcome to Coco Town, ladies and gentlemen. Isn't it beautiful? My name, TMT Coco. Well, I guess it's not obvious. My uh, YouTube name is Mighty Titan Coco, but anyways, good start. Uh, so basically, I'm starting a series here. I don't know how long it'll go. Uh, I'm going to at least try and get the biggest city, and then we'll go from there. I'm playing with no mods. Um, basically, I just wanted to make a series that I could time-lapse like this. It's at uh, four times right now, so it, it should be sped up enough that it's uh, not super slow to watch. So... I picked a map that I've never been on. This one's new to me. I've made a few cities that went to like maximum population or the last unlock at least, and then some. Uh, so this one, it, it took me a while. I haven't played this in probably a year, I think. And full disclosure, I've I'm about four episodes in when I'm doing this commentary, so I'm a little bit ahead. I know what's gonna happen. I know the spoilers, but I won't spoil it. You'll have to uh, stick around and find out, huh? But, uh, yeah, so starting out with a little, I uh, went with a fairly boxy design, just standard square American style, um, in that roundabout from the highway, which just ends up causing so many issues for me, because it's only the small one, because uh, you're really kind of handicapped at the start with what you can use, everything is just so small and designed for little towns, I guess. Um, but yeah, we, we started off all right. Uh, I did, you probably caught at the start, uh, I started out with a road system and then immediately hated it and deleted it instead of just restarting, so that dropped down my starting funds by a fair bit, but that's fine. Uh, so yeah, like I said, I, I have four episodes probably already made and edited, I just need to do the commentary, so I'm going to do those together, and then the future ones after that I'll probably do a commentary like after I play it and edit it rather than doing them as a batch, but I wanted to put these out probably once a week. Um, so four, that's a month worth right there that I can just schedule because I have a little bit of a habit of saying, yeah, I'm going to like make a whole bunch of these or I'll start something with part one and then there there is no part two. It just it doesn't happen. But yeah, this one, I, I would say realistically, if I keep playing it, it would probably be like eh, maybe 15 20 episodes to get to like a really big city that works well and everything uh it might be less than that it really depends how much uh, detail and stuff i put into it i did kind of steal this concept from uh, matt Lown, if anyone's familiar with him his planet coaster series he basically does the same thing he except obviously in planet coaster instead of city skylines but he just takes footage uh speeds it up i think he speeds his up more uh, and then just does the commentary over it. And I thought, hey, that's pretty cool. Uh, and also a lot easier to edit because I really don't have time to do a ton of editing. And this is just speeding it up and cutting a little bit where I need to and stuff. So, um, yeah, but still, like, I, I wasn't sure what speed to go with. I went with four times. Let me know in the comments if you think it should be more or less. Um, it seems fine for me watching it here. Uh, obviously, I'm just watching the preview in hit film. I haven't actually seen it exported, but it... I would imagine it would look the same. Uh, so what I'm doing here, I should probably talk about the footage a little bit. Uh, I wanted to do a little bit of forestry industry because I know that's something that doesn't really pollute much, so you can kind of keep it all the time. Um, but I still put it fairly far away because if I did end up putting more industry there, it just ruins land value. And I mean, I, I want a separate area to put like a landfill and stuff like that because uh, that always just ruins land value and makes everyone angry. So I put it as far away as I could. <clears throat> Good, I'm already losing my voice. We're four minutes in. Great. Um, but yeah, I went with the traditional neighborhood. I don't really know why I put those three industrial buildings there, but um, I did. So that happened. Um, but yeah, I tried to keep industry on the far end as much as possible. Um, little town and then the main road is where i try and put commercial or just on the edge uh, because usually they always have shipments and stuff coming in so you want to keep them separate um i did toy with the concept and you'll probably see it coming up here of uh, naming streets so if you want a street named after you let me know and i will uh i mean if you have a preference for which one i can stick one in um I guess the issue is it'll be a bit behind. So if you see just a plainly named street, like a default street on here, 
and you care which street, just say, hey, I saw this street. Like, just comment and say, can you name it after me? And I'll do it. And you can see yourself in here. Don't even have to be, like, a Patreon member or anything like that. So, super easy. Uh, some of these do end up getting changed the names over. Uh, I think... I think most of this area I did, and then I, I stopped. And obviously, if you do ask for it, I'll do it my time, which, I mean, today is the 26th that I'm doing this, so the next time I play, it'll either be tonight or tomorrow night. But if I'm doing once a week, it'll be like a month before you see it, assuming I don't do what I always do and just say, yeah, there'll be more, and then don't. Um... So yeah, you can see, I'm trying to stay on topic, but I see why it's so difficult for, uh, for Mount Lion you end up rambling. But yeah, Belmont Hills here, uh, I wanted that to be forestry specific, which thankfully you get right from the start. So that makes it a lot easier. Um, we are still, well, actually we're rapidly losing money right now. I don't know what I did wrong there, but holy, we're just dropping like crazy. This was probably a week ago that I played this uh, before the commentary. So th there's going to be a weird time sync. This one I'm hoping will go out on Tuesday. So it'll be like I played it for what you're watching. I played it two weeks ago. I commented on it or I did the commentary a couple days ago, basically. Um, and then obviously for the next four, it'll be kind of more and more progressed uh, into the past or future or uh, I don't know. I, I get lost when it comes to time. I think just, just doesn't work. My brain can't handle it. It's like trying to watch Terminator. It's like, did, did this happen before the other, the other one? I, I don't know what's happening. But, um, yeah. I don't have the game audio going. Be oh, here. I I'm renaming a road. What? Oh, subscribe Boulevard. Maybe you should try that. I don't know. Maybe. Wouldn't, wouldn't you like to like, like and subscribe? Oh, I never made one called like. I just realized that. Um, but yeah, so this is the basis of kind of the small city. And just not having any high density stuff it makes it tricky because like you, you know more stuff is coming. Uh, Tiny Town actually gives me like parks and stuff like that. So that helps. Uh, so I, I try to make the town a little bit nicer here. My issue is I never want to delete anything once I start. Uh, so like all of these houses, traditionally, I would never tear any of them down or anything like that, um, which causes issues for like, if, if you want property value to be good, but you can't fit a park in or something like that. So I told myself in this one, if I had to, I would just tear houses down. Um, that kind of happened. And then <laughs> I kind of stopped because I, I don't know. I feel like guilt of, of some kind for some reason for these people that do nothing but complain but um yeah it's you'll see it a couple times in this one where, where i have to overwrite things but for the most part i kind of drift away from it and i shouldn't but i think once you get far enough along that you have everything unlocked from the start you don't really need to overwrite anyways because you have everything from the start, so you can kind of pre-plan it. Like, I like to put the roads, and then I put parks, and then infrastructure like hospitals and the fire... I almost said fireplace. Firehouse. That's what that's called, right? I'm thinking... Where am I? Is it firehouse subs? I'm thinking... Of, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I like to put everything first and then do the zoning afterwards, which you'll see in later episodes as well. Also, this is three times sped up in-game, too. So those cars are zooming for you, but I mean, from, from what I can see, it looks all right. Um, it, it's still a fairly small town, a lot of walking, which is kind of surprising, I, I guess, cause everything's somewhat close, but usually you kind of expect it to be worse. Putting the park in the middle of that roundabout is the dumbest thing I could have done though, because you end up with people crossing the road into the roundabout which just stops everything and that's kind of the opposite of what you want um i don't learn my lesson though i'm pretty sure i do that again somewhere else because i mean why not it, it, it's pain it's great um but yeah i i haven't got to the point yet where knock off dairy queen i wanted to point that out and i remember that um 
I haven't got to the point where I'm doing a lot of like the cosmetic stuff because you can place like individual trees and everything else, but I haven't really gotten there yet. The goal is basically unlock everything, have a fairly big city, and then kind of, I guess, beautify it. Um, but yeah, the issue, like, it's it's hard to uh, just put a firehouse by the forestry because forestry loves to catch fire just all the time. Um, what was I saying? No, oh, yeah, it's hard to have everything look good right off the bat without, again, just deleting everything afterwards because you don't have everything unlocked at first. So, like, trying to make room for... Um, I, I know I struggle with the train station, the above-ground train station. Um, trying to get that to work when you already have, like, so much of your city built is really rough. So I kind of understand why they struggle with it IRL, too. Um, you can kind of see that I've moved... Well, here I'm looking at all the roads that I can't get trying to make this roundabout bigger already because it just it keeps causing trouble for me in the future um i think by probably well it'll be pre episode four i think i deal with it but you can see when i zoned this part that i kind of left some of it open because i really didn't know what uh what i needed to leave room for here you can see i'm putting paths um so it's just the path tool in in terrain which I always thought it was just decorative, but they do actually use it. So it helps to stop people from crossing intersections, which just slows everything down if they can just kind of cut across. So anywhere that I can put stuff like that, I do. It's really hard to place. You can see it's kind of finicky because when you have the lock, it wants to lock into the road, but then it says it's colliding with it and doesn't let you do it. And then it's kind of tricky to tell if it's actually like, making contact with the road or not sometimes there's a little gap and stuff and here i cut off the entire town's power by putting a path so that one went pretty well that was a stroke of genius from me but yeah i think this episode yeah you can see it's kind of finicky i couldn't tell if it was actually in or not but we are rapidly approaching the end of this episode actually i wanted to keep it short let me know if you think like they should be longer shorter or whatever because if i play for an hour and i make it four times it's 15 minutes so this First one was a little under an hour. Um, here, here I'm, I'm trying to get like a, a nice screenshot. And I wanted to close all the like the UI and stuff. And I couldn't find the control of it for the life of me. So I went through everything. And then I realized it's right in the bottom corner. So I'll find it here in a second. And do a nice little shot. I don't think I Googled it. But I, I was looking around. And then I was like, oh, there it is. So that's a nice shot. It is still three times. I probably should have set it to one. Like, it's three times in-game. Um, but yeah, it's a nice little night shot. And then I think the sun comes up as I'm doing this. Yeah, there it is. It's got nice mountains in the background and stuff. I haven't really moved into the water at all, but I do later on. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, that's pretty much uh, the gist of it here. Let me know if you have any suggestions or if you want your name on the road or something like that. And we can definitely try that. City is about four times as big now. Um, so yeah, ignore Dunzel Washington as one of my save files. But yep, I'm running out of time. Like, subscribe, comment, whatever you want to street, suggestions, etc., etc. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you same time next week. Probably going to be on Tuesday, but we'll see. Thank you and bye.